<laughs> Holy shit. Beetle is in fucking destructible. <laughs> God, because it's a badass. <laughs> the beetle just keeps trucking along. That's fucking crazy. <laughs> Alright. My chance. Oh, why'd you stop? Why'd you stop? Oh. Okay, so mission statement, I have to get the horse to the guy that wants the horse, which is behind the guardian. Let's, let's see if it's even doable. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna take Basura. Oh my god, are you kidding me? It'd be nice if you got distracted by those guys again. I might have to send out Wolf Link. Wolf Link currently, I think he won't get hurt. Fuck you, bitch. Back first die again. Oh, he's alive, he's alive. Nice. Gotta get past here. Jesus Christ. This game is actually wild right now. I know the, the quest for the horse guys around here. But he literally asks for a horse. And that's that's the goal. He, want, he wants to buy a horse. And I'm like, I'll sell you my trash horse. This horse is literally named Basuda. Shit, where is he? Interesting. Here, horsey, come over here. I think the guy, yeah, the guy's at that star, so I just gotta get past this area. So it's probably just like a bunch of different little puzzles. Which, I am not afraid of. Let's see how badly I can fuck this thing up. Run! Nice! Come on, horsey. Come 
Here, go with the program horse. This is why your name is fucking garbage. Oh my god, you're going the wrong way. Jesus Christ. <laughs> yeah, come on. Let's go. Back it up. <laughs> Back it up. <laughs> Jesus. I don't really know how much more trouble we can get in on the way back. I do like this little area. There's gotta be something interesting here to explore. Because this part of the desert's always been interesting to me. The way the, the little structures are. It's just neat. Must have a good horse. Yo, this one's name is literally garbage. Hey, I wasn't expecting anyone to meet anyone out here. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, so I'm a traveler. I was attacked by monsters in this very canyon. And then my horse ran off. Yo, imagine the gall of this person. And like, hey, can I have your horse? <laughs> so that horse, it's a lot. But can I have it for 300 bucks? No. Hey. Yo. I'm fine. I'll give you my horse. Just like my old partner talked about a fine horse. Bro, fuck off. He literally just talked about this. Hey, really? You know this keeps for right? Ah, oh, fuck you. Dude. 300 bucks really isn't even that much money. I brought from you my new partner. Blah blah blah. All right, good good for you, man. You got a horse. <laughs> oh shit! I should have let this guy just terrorize that guy. All right, so let's see here. Anything good? There's some wood. That's not that's not very good. Uh, and here we got flint. Probably more flint over here. And rock salt. Alright, I guess that's something. And let me just go pick up this garbage over here. Alright, now we're horseless. At least Mipha's grace is ready. Uh oh. We'll think. Oh, he, he's, he's not afraid. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Got places to go. Gotta follow my rainbow. Oh, uh, who's that spear? I haven't used a spear in a while. And they are quite helpful. Is that Wolf Link fighting a coyote? <laughs> I love that. I think around here is the Ganon horse, if we could probably find that. So I remember the big ass tree. Let's go back into it. So I know this tree means something. Does that mean the horse is like literally right around here? I don't actually know. Probably not. That'd be pretty convenient. Come on, Wolf Link. You get him. Get him. Come on, buddy. Uh, whatever. You tried. 
Um, so I thought the horse was around here. But I don't see any horses. So that tells me it's not around here. Where are we on the map? Hmm, I know it's like... Gotta be around. Yeah, I'm not trying to fuck with that. Those enemy camps have red, red soldiers in them. This guy might be a dark one. Oh shit! What the fuck just blew that up? Bye. Take that. Oh shit. Okay. Oh fuck. Alright, I tried to skip around them. That didn't really work out. Instead, I'm gonna position myself here. Fly up. Haha, bitches! And look at this. I'll just take your little treasure box. Nice and easy. <laughs> this one has ice arrows. Not too shabby. Which weapons knock the schoolboys out for good? Um, I don't know if there is a weapon, but you just have to, uh, you just have to get their heads. So if you can actually kill their heads in a headshot, then it kills them. Uh, but otherwise, uh, you just gotta hit them, their skull heads fall, and then you can kill them. Here, let me get chat in here. There we go. Chat should be able to come out. See, there's more of these fucking red guys. These guys are ridiculous. Also, I will gladly take your horse. Like these red guys, I swear to god, they're so strong. Like their 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 power is immense. Also, we've gotten the uh We've done the shrines around here. But I'm not sure if I've ever killed this uh this Hinox. So that's what we're gonna do. First things first, I'm gonna snap a little picture of him. Just found me. Probably heal too, just in case. Easy money. And that is light work. Who the fuck is shooting? Oh my god, there's like a tribe over there shooting me. Holy shit, there's a lot of them. Where's my horse? Holy shit. I'll be honest with you, I don't think I can fight all of them. There's a lot of them there. I, I can't believe I killed the Hinox without even seeing them. Holy moly. Is that the horse? Yeah, that's the horse. Let's see if I can grab the horse. Fuck it. <laughs> Yeah, they don't even see me. Trade to this horse, that's fine. Yeah, I wasn't expecting to get hit by that though. I thought I was gonna have a faster draw than him. Damn, and there's two uh, guardians right there? Jesus Christ. Is that three? There's literally three guardians right there. Look at them, it's like Pokemon Snap. <laughs> oh, watch this. Wolf Link. Oh, never mind. Wolf Link is like pretty un indestructible right now. I wonder what's over there. 
That's just like a pretty inconspicuous waterfall. Cosmonaut, have you uh, continued playing Breath of the Wild at all? How far are you in your current playthrough? In celebration for the new game, I'm going to be playing a lot. Tears of the Kingdom is going to be just fucking beautiful. Like, there will be nothing like it. Oh my god, there's like a tribe of people over here too. Oh, the duck. another duck? Yeah, these ducks are cute. I want a picture of one of the ducks. Also, look how fucking fast I can swim. Like, this is absurd. Oh, look at that. That, se that seems worth grabbing. Purple rupee. Not bad, not too shabby. Also, this is like literally faster than walking. Oh shit, there's an attack? It's actually worth using. Dreamlight Valley has taken over recently. I'm messing around mindlessly wandering. I haven't done a Divine Beast, just Towers, Corax, and Shrines. I'll be honest with you, that's where the game is at its best. When you're just like shooting the shit and just wandering the 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 more uh the more chaotic you are with the with the way you path i think the better wolfling returned to his own world if you don't want to wait for me There we go, Jesus. Like some fishies. Damn, I'm like schmoovin'. And this is the Manhala Bridge. I'm gonna restore my stamina real quick, just in case. So, you see the distance right now? It's currently raining, so you actually see some uh, some distance fog. So this is what Breath of the Wild looks like with just upscaled graphics, which I think is actually pretty interesting. Like it has the uh, the ordinary effects that you would see it uh, like happening. I think it's pretty cool. Oh, I should probably take my things too. There we go. Um, when the rain stops, which it will soon. I'll make sure I'll be looking out in the distance so you can see like a before and after. It's actually really interesting because this is what Breath of the Wild looks like ordinarily. Like you can still see pretty far, but the the rain is getting in the way. And it's creating distance fog. So like every individual detail you see out there uh, is different. Like you can even see like the outline of the, of the uh, dual peaks and then directly above my head there's a... Uh, Varuta, the the elephant, and then you got like Death Mountain, Hyrule Castle, like you know the big landmarks. Uh, ooh, Satori Mountains over there. I should probably head over that way. But yeah, as the uh, as the rain starts to fade, so will the fog, and it's gonna it's gonna you'll see the difference. It's actually pretty cool. That said, it might be a minute till. That happens. <laughs> you can see the rain meter in the bottom. I, I think it looks way better without the uh, without the fog. Like when the rain leaves, we'll see it without any of the fog. I think it looks way better. Also, look at this fucking little guy. Oh, I give me money. So it's about to turn 11, so I think the, the shaders might change.
Yeah, the whole thing is gonna look very different in a second. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna chill here. Oh, of course it's an improvement from the Switch. Like the Switch is like it's it's actually insane how how underpowered the Switch is for a game like this. Because this game is gorgeous. And then and they limited it. I, I actually it's funny, Legends of Arceus looks so much better as a PC port. The game looks fucking incredible. It's it's like way it's way better looking than the Switch is able to handle, which is so sad. And I feel like the same thing's gonna happen with Violet and Scarlet. But we'll uh, we'll see, we'll see. That said, it looks like the rain doesn't want to stop, so I guess I'll just keep climbing. It's actually kind of crazy the, the lack of detail you can see from Death Mountain right now. Like, you can't see all of it. But when the when the shader fades, or when the render distance fades, like, you'll see a lot more of it. It's also going to happen in, like, a snap. Like, it'll happen in an instant. I'm very excited for this. That's why I'm sitting there. They came out with an Arceus Chronicle show. That's actually dope. I would I would watch that. Come on. There it is. So that gets rid of all of the render distance fog. So now you can see everything in the in the actual detail and the color. Uh, and I think that's really fucking cool. Like, you can see Dual Link's, uh, or Dual Tink's power. Uh, fuck. Dual Peak's mountain. Uh, you can see Death Mountain in a lot more detail. It's just, oh god, it's so cool. I also changed that to red. Uh, I think it looks really fucking ugly. So I'm gonna uh, I'm actually see if I can change that right now. Cause that's kind of nasty mods got fog castle fog i'm gonna turn the castle fog off seems like that did not get rid of it so we'll just live with it for now <laughs> I probably need to reset for it to fully go through, but that's fine. Just saw it yesterday. I'm going to check it out. Yeah, I mean, it seems like it'd be a cool show. I would watch that. That's sad. So Tori Mountain is our next stop. This is actually one of the coolest areas in the entire game. The Tori Mountain gives you access to one of the best food supplies. And there's just like a really cool little dude. Also, I usually, like, fly in onto Satori Mountain from, like, a Boomizumi. So, like, I'm not used to scaling it like a normal mountain. So that's going to be cool. And we got Wolf Link with us with our his little dark green hair. Oh, man. Oh, jeez. Holy shit. Yeah, you better run. Do I have a speed potion? I have some. There's a shrine on Satori Mountain? You see any of this season of Rick and Morty? I saw the first episode. Is there more yet? Like, did the second one come out? I guess a week passed. Like, Sunday was the other day. So there should be another episode. Fuck you, goat. Yeah, that's what I thought. Blah! Little goat bitch. I wonder where the shrine is. I didn't know there was a shrine on this mountain. That makes this spot even more high value.
There's the bloopy. Damn it. Oh, I guess that one counts. <laughs> I'm like jumping off a cliff. <laughs> oh, let's see if I get a better picture of a bloopy. You have three to see? Oh my goodness, there's three more? That's actually fantastic news. Alright, let's put on our thing. Link, you need to stay here. Cause you're gonna you're gonna freak some people out. It's one with a clone beth. Wait, clone beth is the third episode? I thought that was the first. Alright, so first off, get a nice picture of the King of the Mountains. Because a Lord of the Mountains, my bad. And now let's get the bloopies, because they're really cool. Oh shit, did I already get caught? Alright, just buy the bloopies. Okay. We have more than enough stamina to mount the King of the Mountains. It's just a matter of if I can actually get there. Because he can hear you way better than most other horses. Link! Oh my god. <laughs> Link just showed up for no reason. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. This is fine. This is fine. Oh my god. Holy shit. Jesus. I can't use the, the camera while I'm on him, sadly. But, we got him. She's in all of them, but the third episode is more involved. I just know the one where they rescue Rick and Morty. So, like, I didn't, I didn't see a lot, I'm guessing. Also, this is dope that I have the King of the Mountains. <laughs> but, yeah, the, the, the one episode I saw was fantastic. Like, the, uh, the show definitely picked up where it left off and then some. Wow. And I know if you get off the King of Mountains, he'll just run away forever. So let's go do some shit. I know there's some special stuff that you can see while you're riding him. So let's see what happens. He's also really fast. Like, I guarantee you, even though Wolf Link has a speed bust, uh, bonus right now, he won't get a... He won't get to keep up. Gotta see the Thanksgiving episode. I, I will watch it for sure. That might be the move. Also, look at all that fog again. That's the rain fog. It's actually crazy what a difference it makes. Because the game is still really pretty with it. So it's crazy how it how they make it work. I don't know. This is wild. I'm begging. It's hysterical. Oh, I'll, I'll, I should watch it like soon. Oh my god, the sunset is dope. It's okay, buddy. Here we go. What's up, horses? They're like, what the fuck is this? I've actually never seen all this detail on the side of him before. Looks like a painting. It does look like a painting, I agree. Is this a road? Oh, there's flat in that guy. Oh shit, this is the horse statue. Wait a second, this, there's a core memory here, and then from here you can also get Zelda. Or Zelda's horse. Well, I'm starring this. This is actually a really, really important area. I totally forgot that this was right here. So this horse statue has a memory near it. Yeah, yeah, can I do it while I'm on the mountain horse? Like the Lord of the King of the Mountains, or do I have to stand still? be glowing. Oh shit, there's just a person here. 
Also, it gets really dark with the shaders off. That's actually kind of interesting. Yeah. Even from this park, you can take a look and you can see Hyrule Castle. See it? Mm. However, I can't really enjoy the view. I can't explain it. I just feel uneasy when I look at it. I mean, yeah, there's kind of <laughs> demons coming from it and stuff. I see. I become overwhelmed with dread. <laughs> There's at least a 400 rupee horse right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's there's a lot of stuff right over here. I have to come back here when I don't have the Lord of Mountains so I can actually, like, pick up all this shit. I, I want to hold on to him. I want to see if I can go to his stable just to get the rare dialogue. There's a stable south of us. Yo, that's the horse! That's Zelda's horse right there. It's the only white horse in the game. Should I just, like, catch it with the Lord of the Mountains? I'll just use the Lord of the Mountains to get it. You're cornered. You're not going anywhere. Oh, so you can get off the Lord of the Mountains. That's interesting. Well, at least I know that the horse is right here. It's not going to go anywhere. It belongs in this field. So that's okay. All right, let's go south, I think, for the uh, for the stable. Fuck the dialogue. I mean, yeah, I've seen the dialogue. That's the thing. Where'd the horse go? There she is. First, let's take a picture. Oh, he's just staying still. What a kind little fellow. <laughs> He's so cute. Oh, here, I want to get a squirt picture. Oh, shit. Oh, I shouldn't have kept that picture. Oh, I fucked up. <laughs> That's okay. Hello, horsey. You, you, you look a little stuck. Let's, let's get you down from here. <laughs> I know, I know. This is a really good horse to get, though. And now let's really go to that stable. Which, again, I believe is south, so it's in this direction. Holy shit, this horse is, like, way faster than the other horse. Like, I thought the Lord of the Mountains had max stats, but this is crazy. Uh-oh. Uh. Okay, I need to focus. I need to save the bell right now. with a 40 power weapon too that guy had like triple health or some shit that one was probably made specifically to guard this horse which by the way where the fuck did zelda's horse go there's no way it died is is there oh he's over here okay Whew. all right all right now that that's out of the way holy shit she's fast like, this is insane. That's okay. Alright, so now we gotta use the road out of this. Out of this. Uh, forest. And then we have to veer to the right. Holy shit. That's what I get for looking at the map. <laughs> This horse probably hates me. Holy shit. 
I should go to Ganon's horse next. Actually, that might be the next uh, plan of action. Oh. Mahala Bridge. I was underneath here before. It's okay, we got this. For now, let's not go max speed. That seems to be getting me into some some troublesome situations. All right, there's a guardian up here, but I think it's a stationary one. Oh, sorry, I, I overworked the horse. Yeah, let's register it. Gotcha. New horse. Uh, what should I name this horse? Um. Yeah, yeah, 20 rupees, that's fine. Uh. I could just name it Zelda's horse. Let's call it... Um, I don't actually know. Zara. Fuck it. Zara. Zara Zelda's horse. Damn, it's got max stats. That's fucking insane. I'm gonna board the horse, actually. I don't want it. So, we got that horse. Now, I still think this area, I was here before. I'm pretty sure this is where you can get the other horse. Let me actually think about this. I think you can get it from this tower. Oh, I actually just looked it up. It's down here. I thought it was up here, but it's in the same type of area. So I'm gonna go... Down this way. This is kinda cool. I never thought about this little area before. Holy shit, there's a lot of lasers coming at me. Yeah, but doesn't this look like a boss fight? It's like super wide open area. It's interesting for sure. This is probably a Korok. Oh, you can't even lift this rock. What is this area? Like surely there's not nothing here. Alas. We were still heading yonder. I also think it's crazy that you can see the whole fucking desert. Like, this is all rendered on one screen. It's like the, uh, the big smoke clouds coming from the camel. Have I done that shrine yet? Yeah, I have. I was like, I love those shrines. Those little labyrinth fuckers. And here we got the beautiful sunrise.
Oh shit. gonna ex expel myself from that situation. Yeah, I agree. Like, just the amount that it's actually able to do. that weird flamingo thing all right so these are the trees surely it's in this area i am the lorax i speak for the trees look at everything loading in it's the first time i've actually been in this area that's kind of cool So is the horse over here? That's him. That's the guy. Look at him, he's so beautiful. Honestly, we could probably just swoop in on him. There's, there's no boss fight to be had here. There are some monsters. But, oh shit. Did he notice me? Oh fuck. I have to actually be clever about how I get this horse, then. Come on. Alright. Ah, fuck. There we go. Come on. There we go. Bye, bitch. Alright. That, that's that's the that's the Ganon horse right there. See how this horse is like four times as big as the other horses? And he's he is quite strong. He actually can't go fast though. Like he doesn't have a speed boost. Which is actually kinda wild. It's okay. He, he sure does like to complain though. I wonder how he fares against a guardian. I probably shouldn't want to find out that information, but I want to find out that information. But yeah, look at this. We can just like stab things on our way. Oh fuck! That guy's got a good bow. Oh no. There's the guardian. Alright, what kind of bow do I have? Please break the fucking limbs, Jesus Christ. Bitch. Just chopping away at these guys. Nice and easy. Alright, that said, ooh, there's a shrine around here. Oh, come on, big guy. Where's the nearest shrine from here? Or stable. Do I have to go all the way back up? I don't even think I can go back up. I don't know how I'm going to get to another stable. I guess I'm just going to keep exploring until I find one.
I love that. I don't know if you heard it, but there's like a string going on while you do the horse in the daytime. And it plays Zelda's lullaby. And of course, as soon as I uh, reminisce on the song, I get attacked by the monster. Holy shit. Holy shit. It's like he's not even missing limbs, Jesus Christ. Fuck off, please. Jesus. That's like always stressful. It's never not like a painful situation to deal with a fucking guardian. Especially when I'm trying to escort this big ass horse. I think I just got stuck. Come on. Starting to hate this horse. So much more trouble than it's worth. Doesn't help that I really don't know where I'm going either. Like right now, I'm on the cliff. Just kind of hoping there'd be something for me to go to. I'm gonna have to come back the way I came, actually. See you later, asshole. Alright, so coming up this way was a mistake. I know that. I can admit that. Yeah, but I can't be more excited for Tears of the Kingdom, I'll be honest. Like, it's gonna be amazing. <laughs> Tell me those are two Lynels. Oh, he sees me. Okay, he's ignoring me. Alright, I managed to evade the Lynels. Yeah, Tears of the Kingdom is going to be an amazing time sink for sure. It's going to be one of the best games just ever. Like, I'm still playing Breath of the Wild, and Breath of the Wild came out fucking five years ago. Half a decade, and I'm still playing it and enjoying it like it's a brand new video game. Like, that is unprecedented. Holy shit. Wow. Oh shit. Would you look at that? That's like the border of like what's rendered. Holy shit. 
Imagine that was explorable. Imagine there was stuff explorable in the sky. Wow. Alright, that's wild. I still say this game is beyond its time. Ah, oh, shit. He sees me. Oh my god, he has bomb arrows? Are you kidding? Oh, when was the last time I saved? Oh my god. I was finally out of the desert, too. Oh, shit. Alright, alright, I still have this guy. I'm actually not that far from where I was, that's okay. This time I'm gonna learn from my mistake, and I'm gonna heal. Eat some food. Are you kidding me? So these guys have ancient arrows. So that's cool. Oh my god. What a camp. I can't believe I almost just snuck past them last time. Yeah, I'm gonna try it one more time just like to slip through. Never mind. Um, I don't have any more bomb arrows. I can freeze their horses. That's actually a pretty good idea. I have a bunch of ice arrows. So first off, heal. Second off, get a good-ass bow. Third off, ice arrows. And next, we're going to do some pro gamer shit. Maybe I should save. Oh my god. He died immediately. <laughs> maybe there's a, maybe there's a little bit more finesse that I could be doing here. Because I'm trying to barge through, but maybe if I go in, prep my horse for a line of running, and then I will hop off. It's okay, calm down. Now, all of them seem to be a little bit easier to deal with. Heal up one more time, because I just got fucked up. And let's hope. Like, literally, I'm just gonna hope and pray. Oh my god. Holy shit. Holy shit. Yo. Yo. Horse, it's not the time. Oh, there it is. <laughs> so he's got a five times ancient bow with ancient arrows. Oh shit, it's saved. It saved while I went past him. Alright, I'm marking this guy on my map. This is worth coming back for. That's just like a stacked bow. Alright, now we're back on the uh, beaten path. And that means that we are going to find a stable eventually. <laughs> if we have to go all the way up to this one, I'll do it. Just for, just for Ganon's horse. I hope that one's stationary. Truly, like, I'm running really low on weapons, and I didn't think that was going to happen, like, this late in the game. <laughs> Damn. 
I missed that like five times. All right, let's go. All right, so we got Zelda's horse, and now we got this horse. The other one I named Zyra. What's a, what's a complimentary name to Zyra? Oh shit, this is the tropical area. We have to come back here, too. That said, let's go back into here. Seems like there's a shrine the other way. Oh, and there's a stable. Perfect. Zyra and Zuri. Fuck it. I like it. Zuri. Nah. Yeah, let's register it. Mm -hmm. He's big. Even his picture's big. I can't believe it's only 20 bucks. Like, that's so cheap. Let's go. Three? Yeah, fuck it. Um, let's board this horse too. Now, there is one other horse that I want to get. I'm gonna have to look through my downloads folder to see if I can actually get it. So, give me one second. I'm looking for something very specific. Uh, maybe I'll have to find it another day. Because I need to get the Wolf Link Amiibo data. Or sorry, the uh, Epona Link. Because I just need the download pack with all the files. This is perfect so I'm just waiting for the fucking hey guys, rain. What's up and welcome back to BSOD Gaming. In this video, I'm going to show you Yeah, I don't really care. Here we go. Here's all the NFC tags. As of March 4th, 2017. Well, I guess that's something. <laughs> I'm gonna go to Zelda. I'm gonna go to 30th anniversary. So I want the Ocarina of Time amiibo. I want the Toon Link amiibo. And I want the Link Rider amiibo. Okay. So first things first. Oh, what's going on over there? <laughs> There's terrorizing an NPC. That's fucking funny as shit. <laughs> All right. So first things first, I'm gonna go here, and then I have to grab the NFC file. I can grab one from the desktop, I believe. And let's do Link Rider. And this should give us. This is not what it should give us. Not what I wanted. I might have to do this a bunch of times. FC, I'm gonna go with Rider. No.
I have to do it twice. So this is not giving me what I wanted. Also, I don't care about anything in these chests. <laughs> that's that though. That's nice to know that I don't need to uh, reset every time. So I'm looking for the Smash Bros. Amiibo in that case. So let me go to Super Smash Bros. and get Link. Because the Rider Amiibo might be just a completely different Amiibo. There it is. That's our girl. Now we have Epona. And that's all the horses. Luckily, I, I already have the NFC files and shit, so I got I, I don't gotta worry about having an amiibo. But yeah, we're gonna we're gonna register this horse. Absolutely. Oh, please enter a name for your horse. Wait a minute. Isn't this Epona the horse of legend? What do you think? You can't rename a horse of legend. I'm pretty sure that's against the law. So Epona it is. Uh, can I try to change it? No, I told you. We can't rename the legendary horse. Her name must be Epona. That's okay. I actually want her name to be Epona. And let's board the horse. I want to see all the horses in there. Now we have all three legendary horses, which is actually kind of cool. I, I like that that's what we ended up doing. But we have Zyra, Zelda's horse. We got Zuri, Ganon's horse. And we got Epona, which is obviously Link's horse. And Barney is apparently the legendary hero Linkle's horse. So that's that's quite funny. Shout out to Barney. And I don't know if he's like gray and he looks purple to me, but he looks very purple to me. <laughs> so that's funny. Additionally, I want to use the amiibo file to get the Ocarina of Time outfit, because I want to know what that looks like on Linkle. So I'm going to go here for the Ocarina of Time amiibo. And I'm just going to keep opening the chests and hope I get what I want. Shock arrow, that is not what I want. A cap of time. All right, so this would be the regular hat. I'm assuming there's a whole outfit that goes with it, so we're just gonna keep going. Because some of these outfits you can actually only get through Amiibo, so it's pretty cool that we're gonna be getting them. Ocarina of Time. The Tunic of Time. Yeah, so this is going to be Linkle's classic outfit, which I think is going to be pretty cool looking. And this is what it looks like with just what we have, but let's also try and get the Trousers of Time. Additionally, there's also some Wind Waker clothes, so that could be worth getting with the Toon Link amiibo. What's my favorite outfit so far? Um, so I really like, so this is the, the default outfit, and I think it looks pretty good. I like it better in black, uh, because it's just more applicable and you can mix and match it with other things. So I like putting on this blue with the black. I think that just looks really good. Um, additionally, I think the Chica outfit looks the best. I think it looks really cool. Um, the Zora outfit's probably the ugliest, but it's, 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 it is here. Uh, the Flame Breaker outfit, though, is by far my favorite. And you can wear it with pretty much anything. I actually think I'm gonna wear it with a cap of time a little bit more. Because I like this little outfit. I like this hairstyle. Uh, but yeah. So that's, that's where I'm at currently. As far as my favorites. And I'm still going to try and get the uh, the other Amiibo outfits. And that'll probably be the last thing I do today. More shock arrows. I know there's treasures of time. Like, I know for a fact. 
There they are. Oh, they're little green shorts. <laughs> Alright, so this outfit just became mid. But the shorts are pretty nice. Kind of don't really look. You kind of can't really see them with, uh, with all, the, all the other things. Yeah, so that outfit, I, I, I don't want to say it's mid, but it's pretty mid. So let me go here for Toon Link. Scan from Tag. And we're going to grab Toon the Wind Waker. This one's going to give us a bunch of fish, which I think is funny. Trousers of the Wind. Nice. So that's already the first one. Let's see. Let's go back to Toon Link. And they will just be flapping around. I'm gonna go back to Toon Link. Uh, I didn't want to pick up the fish, but that's fine. Nobody can make the Zora work. Yeah, the Zora just looks ugly. I don't know. Like, it's just not it's just not a good look. So it's giving us some weapons, which is nice, just so I don't have to go find some more. <laughs> it's kind of lame, if you think about it. <laughs> yeah, with the flip-flopping, yeah, it's crazy. Toon Link. Fuck. Open the chest. Jesus Christ. The Sea Breeze Boomerang. That's actually pretty cool. Zelda has a Bow of Light. That's actually one of the coolest items in the game. I might actually try to grab that. Because it's not that powerful, but it's really cool. You get that with the Zelda Twilight Princess in you, though. Also, this is so much easier than having to reset every time. Because ordinarily you have to do this once a day. Ah, another Sea Breeze Boomerang, that's fine. Shock arrows. Cap of the wind. Oh shit, they got glasses? Okay, okay. And there's also Twilight Princess armor. Twilight Princess Link armor that I could probably go for as well. Because at this point I may as well. Like, I'm, ar I'm already grinding for them all. also very little reason for me not to. Alright, I also want to do this during the daytime, so I'm just going to wait real quick. Ice arrows. Honestly, this is fine. I also don't feel guilty about the things I'm getting because they're just disposable weapons. And, like, weapons are so easy to come across. <laughs> like, it's actually so easy to fill up your inventory. Maybe not specifically with Sea Breeze Boomerangs, mind you, but still very, very easy. Toon Link. There we go, Tunic of the Wild. <laughs> oh god. Alright, I hate it. <laughs> I fucking hate it. <laughs> I'm never wearing this again. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Like, the the, the, knee, the, the knee socks are, aren't bad. But it's just the, the schoolgirl skirt outfit. No, that is, that is not for me. 
I, I do like the, the glasses, though. Oh, that's, a, that's a neat touch. Now let's go for the Twilight Princess points. Holy shit. That's actually a fantastic sword. I'll probably drop some of the swords just because I feel like I'm cheating. Yeah, right. It's, it's, it's bad, right? <laughs> Inventory's full, that's fine. Fire arrow. So there's the Twilight Princess, there's the Wind Waker, and there's the Ocarina of Time. Is there another one? I don't think there is. Oh, Cap of the Wild. Look at that hair. Yo! That's so cool. I actually haven't had an outfit where I can have my hair out. Like, all of them are up or, or hidden. Nice. Yeah, the schoolgirl aesthetic, especially in Legend of Zelda, like, like, Link, Link's little lolly, you know? Oh my god. Get, get out of here. Go for Link again. This is gonna be the Twilight Princess stuff. Browsers of Twilight. Okay, okay. I wonder what the middle is gonna be. Another sword. Another sword. He's got a sword! You idiots! We've all got swords! <laughs> He's just gonna ignore me? He's like, alright, bye. Keep it coming. Eventually I'll find it. Imagine it's like every 10 or something. Like it's actually like a number. Tunic of Twilight. Ooh, it's like a dress. Holy shit. I mean... It's big. It's, it's, it's big. <laughs> I want that cyan one. Oh shit. Oh shit, okay. So, side saddle situation kind of doesn't work. I don't know how I feel about the dress. The dress is, is pretty. I don't know how I feel about it, <laughs> I'll be honest. <laughs> it's interesting. Like, it's better than this dress. This dress is pretty ugly. Actually, it looks it, that looks a lot better with this outfit. Hmm. I'll be honest with you, the, uh, the hair is probably my favorite part of the ones that we just got. Like, I'm very happy we got that. Look at her. It is very, very floofy, I agree. It, perhaps a bit too floofy. And let's, uh, let's catch another horse. Fuck it. Let's fill up our horse. This one's blue. Uh, it's a bit too glitchy. I agree. Like, it doesn't, it doesn't look good. Uh... Um, blue horse, blue horse. Uh, I don't know. 
Ponyta. No, I hate that name. Uh, Ah. Yeah, I'll take this horse. This, this one I'll actually keep with me. <laughs> Alright, and then the last thing I want to do is I want to get the, uh, the Zelda amiibo so I can get some of the... Where is it? Some of the, there's this one bow and arrow that I really want. And that's the last thing I'm probably going to be looking for. NFC... Scan from tag, and let's go to Zelda. Who knows, maybe I'll get it like first try. <laughs> but yeah, it's called the Bow of Twilight. It's the only one that I actually really want. All the other like specialty weapons I'll get it another time when I'm like actually trying to complete my decks and stuff. But for now, this is more than enough. The straight colors like that are supposed to be Aster, right? The straight colors like that. What do you mean? I have no idea what that means. What straight colors? Oh, faster. Faster. Yes, they're faster and stronger. The uh, the solid ones. And then the spotted ones, they're easier to catch, but they're like way weaker. So they're almost not even get, uh, worth grabbing. Go, go. Yeah, yeah, faster. Yeah, that's a. Uh, they, they are much, much stronger. They're way better. Let's see. Let's go back to Zelda. I've got to find this shit eventually. More fucking precious metals. I don't care about this shit. Am I sure it's this one? I'm pretty sure it's this one. But am I sure I'm sure? Who the fuck is Amber? <laughs> Jesus. So many fucking sapphires. I don't, I don't care about the money. I'm really gonna throw all this shit out. Unless the bow of Twilight has just been replaced. And it's like not even in this drop. Jesus. I feel like I'm shiny hunting. Yeah, I'm not convinced this is possible. The one I want might just not exist.
See, I would trust the process, but the only bow I'm getting is the Royal Guards bow, which tells me that it might be the only one that's available in this pool with the mod. Because I, I, I feel like I would have seen it by now. I also now have like 20 opals, and I don't need them. At last, the sun has come out. Am I sure I'm getting the right one? In the Legend of Zelda one, They have a Zelda one. I'm gonna go for the Breath of the Wild Zelda one rather than the Smash Bros. Zelda one. Let's see if that does some different some different pool of things to draw from. I don't think it does, but well, let's, let's see. Still getting gems. I can also go in with a save editor if I really, really want it, but I, I guess I, I guess I might just give up on the dream. All right, I'm dropping shit. I guess this looks about right. Chimney Christmas. I think I haven't taken a picture of. I haven't done a treasure chest yet? Wow. album is full. You don't want to take so many pictures? What the fuck? Yeah, yeah. What are the chances that you made me here? What do you got, Beetle? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna clear out your stock. Easy money. Free SJ man. I'll be honest with you. I I don't really know who SJ man is. By the way, the game looks fucking terrible. What do you mean it looks terrible? <laughs> what looks terrible about it? Unless it's like the stream that's making it look bad. 
the shader you're using. I'm actually using no shaders. I actually really like the way it looks. I think the uh, the outreaching distance, like you could just see farther, like without the distance fog. I think that looks really good. Um, and I, I like the the more vibrant colors. Nick, have you played on uh, the uh, the emulator before? Let's see here. I think this is a pretty easy shrine. If I recall, you just gotta like walk up a couple times and then that's it. Jesus, what an easy shrine. <laughs> like, it's not even a two-step process. <laughs> it's just, it just go to the location you are trying to go to. Oh. I wonder if I can still climb that. I can! Nice and easy. I have a fuck ton of spirit orbs. I just haven't cashed them in because I don't want my health to get too high, but I'm already at like almost the first health wheel or the first health line filled. And I could probably, because each, each spirit orb is only, or each health container is only two spirit orbs. So I could probably get like a good six of them now, which is a lot. I could also get another stamina wheel if I really want one, but three is like, it's proven to be more than enough, I feel like. Ooh. Alright, but that said, where are we headed? Oh, and then naturally, the uh, the most important amiibo that we have to make sure that we're using at all times. We got Wolf Link in the house! Alright, let's do it. Oh my god, hello? My dude. Jesus. Oh my god, my horse just like, literally went right to the right. Should be a shrine around here. There it is. The Pumagnite Shrine. Yo, Nick, if you're still here, what's, uh, who is SJ, man? <laughs> like, I'm, I'm genuinely curious at this point. <laughs> is this a major test of strength? A minor test of strength? This isn't even worth my fucking time. I don't need a regular-ass sword. Oh, my God. Let's get this over with. <laughs> minor tests of strength are literally nothing. Come on, bitch. 300 health. 
literally nothing. <laughs> Fucking easy. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> 300 health is literally nothing. Oh, I should probably grab his ancient parts. Oh, man. Like, you can at least try to make it interesting. A Royal Guard sword, very nice. Alright, now I got 14 spirit orbs. Honestly, I'm gonna start uh, cashing them in as hearts. Because, like, at this point, there's no reason not to. I mostly use yellow health anyway, or at least I plan to. Because at this point, like, with how many health bars I... Or how many health containers I actually have, there's really no reason for me to be dying. Also, additionally, uh, I don't know how you can look at this, like, and think this looks bad. <laughs> like, we got higher detailing, we got the, the shaders removed. Like, I, I, I think this looks absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> I, I'm actually shocked that, that you think otherwise, Nick. Shout out to you. Also, this dress looks like shit. <laughs> I, I don't like it. <laughs> but, I wonder what my best outfit is currently. Like, this one's still really good. Interesting. Nice. Alright, so that said, the last thing we're probably going to do today is heal up. I'm going to go to Kakariko Village to go ahead and do that. And we're going to restore our health all the way back up to full. Uh, and redeem all of our heart containers. We're going to have seven additional hearts, so we're going to have five in the next row. I'm more fan of Renaissance dresses than Victorian dresses. I actually agree. I think the uh, the Renaissance one looks like just a little bit, I don't know, a little bit more sporty. I don't know. But I, I'd agree. Let's go into Kakariko Village, my favorite place in the world. And we're just gonna keep doing this. <laughs> I'm gonna get a bunch of heart containers. Yeah, I mean, I already have three stamina vessels, so getting more doesn't really do me any good. Actually, in Breath of the Wild, I've never had more than one line of hearts. Like, I never, I never bothered. I just, I did everything in a stamina. Because stamina vessels were a lot harder to get in this game. Go and bring peace to Hyrule. Damn. That's actually wild. Oh, 
Oh, I missed a blood moon. Oh man. Blood moon rises once again. See, this is what the game actually looks like. Yeah, I think this looks way worse. It's also in 30 FPS. Yeah, whoever Nick was, he he did not know what he was talking about. <laughs> wait for my textures to reload because this does not look correct my outfit looks all trippy There we go, that reloaded. 